Okay, here's some uh, helping hands that I made that I'm really happy with. They're flexible, they bend, they twist, they move easily into all positions. You can see how easy it is to line up like that wire for soldering. It's a little bit better, I think, than uh, traditional helping hands because with the traditional helping hands, you know, they'll often pull the wire perpendicular to the alligator clips. You can't quite uh, adjust the uh, the distance between those, and sometimes it just it's just kind of a little bit uh, difficult to get the thing lined up exactly as you like. This is made with um, RG402 coax cable. You can find it on eBay. You can see, well, I hope you can see, there's a, there's the coax center in there. They use this for antennas. And the important thing is it has a shape which uh, will keep if you bend it into position. And that's what I noticed about it. And to make it, it was pretty straightforward. I just cut a length of the coax cable. I use the crimpers and just crimped uh, the alligator clips on like that and it holds really well you can see how tight that is and you can see that it twists it bends it's got all you know the flexibility that you need i put uh, some heat shrink tube onto the alligator clips so that it wouldn't bite into the wire you can see this one here i've got uh, the heat shrink done and then I just drilled some holes. I think a 9 64th inch hole was what I used. And you can see it's just really nice. It just sticks right in there and lines everything up. Anyways, I thought it was useful and I thought you might uh, think it was useful as well.